In this video, we are going to solve a previous gate problem related to Nyquist stability criteria and enclosement. So, now you can observe this problem. A unity feedback system has the open loop transfer function g of s is equal into 1 by s minus 1 into s plus 2 into s plus 3. The Nyquist plot encircle the origin. So, how many times the Nyquist plot encircle the origin? They are asking never that is going to encircle. So, option B once, option C twice, option D thrice. So, if this is the unity feedback open loop transfer function of a system, so if you take a Nyquist plot for this, how many times that Nyquist plot is going to encircle the origin they are asking. So, number of encirclements we are having a problem, uh, we are having a formula. So, here in the last class itself I told about that number of encirclements. So, number of encirclements is equal to so poles minus zeros where n is equal to number of encirclements number of encirclements by the Nyquist plot of g of s into h of s. So, where n is the number of encirclements of the origin you can take of the origin by the Nyquist plot of g of s into h of s. So, this is what we need to find out. For this the formula is p minus z where p is poles which poles right sided poles right sided poles number of right sided poles number of right sided poles where z is equal to number of right sided zeros. So, by taking number of right sided poles minus number of right sided zeros you can find out how many times our Nyquist plot is going to encircle the origin. Now, coming to this, how we can find the number of poles and zeros? If you observe the number of poles here, so here if you equate, if you equate g of s into h of s poles to 0, you will get the number of poles. So, here the denominator s terms if you are equating to 0, do not confuse why I am taking g of s in place of g of s into h of s means h of s is equal to 1 because unity feedback system. So, if you are calculating g of s and h of s means you are calculating for g of s only. So, here for this number of encirclements by the Nyquist plot of g of s into h of s means Nyquist plot of this open loop transfer function only. So, here by equating these terms to 0, then you are getting s is equal to 1, s is equal to minus 2 and s is equal to 3. So, now you can see in s plane, one pole is in the right half of s plane. If this is s plane, this is real axis and this is imaginary axis. If you observe one pole, S is equal to 1 pole is in the right half of S plane, remaining 2 will be in the left half of S plane. You can see here. So, the number of right sided poles is equal to 1 and the number of right sided zeros is equal to 0. There is no right sided zeros, only poles are there, there is no zeros because here we are not having any numerator. So, that is why we are not having any zeros. If you are not having any zeros, no need to find out how many are right sided or left sided. No need to bother about right and left whenever you are not having any number of zeros. So, now here the number of right sided poles is equal to 1, number of right sided zeros equal to 0. So, by taking these two into consideration, we can calculate number of enclosements of the origin by the Nyquist plot of g of s into h of s. 1 minus 0, this is equal to 1. So, one time, 
one time our nyquist plot is going to encircle the horizon so like this like this also we can trace diagrams in the options for example same problem is given and they will ask like this choose the appropriate nyquist plot in the below diagrams so then in that diagrams we can trace like this also according to the encirclements of the horizon also we can trace the apt diagram for the given transfer function